Oh, what's happening, my people? So it's your boy Chance Jolivet, aka Smooth, back with another music review. This one right here is not gonna be a long one. I'm not gonna go into super detail with every song or whatnot. I listened to this on the go. I wasn't writing notes like I normally do uh, to tell you about every song, what they about, and blase blase. Uh, so I'm just gonna talk about this as a whole complete body of work. So this right here is Sanfa, and the title of this album is called Lahai, Lahi, Lahai, something like that. But it is 14 songs, 41 minutes runtime, and it is not your traditional like R&B type stuff. Like it is beautiful singing, it is a vibe, it is calming, it is soothing. If you like like some Sade type stuff or something, not not necessarily saying it's Sade or something. I'm just trying to think of things that are in that lane, but just like in that realm, he's not singing your, your draws off or anything. It's not no Joe to see uh, type stuff that he's singing. Uh, if you're not familiar with Sanford, you should be. Uh, if you like like Drake's song. Too much, too much, too much, too much. That sample. So he sung way better than me. But anyways, like sample was on a few like Drake tracks and stuff, like big artists. So you have heard him, even if you don't think that you have heard him. But his other album was very dope. And this right here, it doesn't disappoint. I don't know if this is necessarily gonna be for everybody. Like if you were in your ratchet bag or something, you want something to to bounce your ass to, you want something to bump and grind to or something like that. It's not necessarily that. You want to want to get you a nice bubble bath, uh, some wine or something like that. This might be might be something that you're interested in uh, listening to. If you're somebody like me and you like to listen to music while you're going to sleep. Like every time I go to sleep, I put some music on or something. This is definitely one that I'll be able to play in just something that's soothing to the mind or something and I'll be able to listen to that and go to sleep or whatever. And not saying it's boring, it'll put me to sleep. It's just, it's soothing. Like his melodies and stuff, man, like this is a beautiful body of work. It is something, he doesn't sound like too many other people, like anybody else. He has his own style. The direction of the music, man, the production, just everything is smooth, very, very smooth. And overall, I would give this project, I would give this like a nine, a 8.8. I give this a 8.8 .8 out of 10. A 9.2. <laughs> I give this a 9.2 out of 10. I'm very much, I definitely like this project, man. Uh, Jesse Boyk is the third. He dropped the album. Uh, my girl Alex Ivy dropped something. This sample, hey, this is it's, it's dope. I rate this better than both of those projects, but I think Jesse Boyk is probably gonna be the one I listen to the most. I'm just a big fan and has a lot of replay value. This right here, I will be listening to, but I think I'm gonna listen to Jesse a little bit more. But I artistically, I put this one over that because Jesse had a few songs that I didn't like that I didn't like. This doesn't have any songs that I don't like. Like I like about every song on here. There's nothing that I dislike. It's very dope. But anyways, man, I didn't want this to be too long. But check this out, Sanfa, Lahai, Lehi, whatever how you ever you pronounce it. Anyways, like, comment, subscribe. Gonna be the greatest of the most hated, man. Y'all check that out.